What's up guys? This is going to be uh, another knife video. This is a uh, 3 16 ATS 34. Overall is a 21 inch, I think with a 13 inch blade. Slack belt, grind, but pretty thin. Swedge on the back, unsharpened. Uh, Lino micarta, white spacers, the paracord wrap. The only reason I paracord wrapped it is because it was uh, give me a blister here. Uh, that's one of the things I like about testing my knives that I make, is to know where the problems are going to occur with it before I actually <clears throat> make another one and sell it. Uh, I guess we're just going to do a little chopping video here. And I do not have the, the best setup for all this, so you have to bear with me. So there's a little bit there. This wood's uh I don't know, right right here is probably eight inches across. Yeah, so uh pretty thick stuff. It's a, uh, I think it's pine, so it's not real tough to cut. On the other hand, this stuff over here is locust that I didn't chop up, or didn't cut up, I should say, with a chainsaw. I didn't split it, so it's <laughs> extremely hard. Just listen to this. But uh, with power, you can cut some of it. We'll see if we can do this uh, smaller piece right here. So, there you go. Blade actually got hot from that one. Not easy stuff to cut at all. Uh, it's very hard, very fine grain, and uh, pretty dense. Not the densest I worked with, but it's, it's dense. I think I got uh, some... Uh, Thinner locust over here, I'll show you quick. Now with this stuff, I got to the core where it's brown, right here, and it's just, it's hard. I mean, you can just hear the, and this was cut recently, but I cut into this two or three days ago, and it's already hard. Uh, I like testing my knives on this kind of thing, because if it can handle this kind of wood, it can just about handle anything. Now this grind is thicker than I would have liked, but 
with the thicker grind, I also get a better edge retention, uh, no deformation, no chipping, nothing like that. So it's not going to have quite as much bite as a thinner grind, but it does hold up relatively well. Because I've been chopping with this, I don't know, six, seven hours on this hardwood. It's held up pretty well. It's not a super razor sharp now, but it still has a usable edge. So uh, I think we're going to try to get some of this in frame. Nope. How about this right here? <coughs> no way. Okay. Huh. Well, I guess we're just going to continue right here. stuff is tough. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to try to get through this. Yeah, no. <laughs> I do got a piece of wood over here that I do not know what it is, but we'll try that. So, uh, Whatever this stuff is, freaking sun. Whatever this stuff is here, I have no idea what it is, but it's incredibly heavy. I mean, just this piece here probably weighs, I don't know, 30, 35 pounds. But if you guys know what wood it is, let me know. I'm kind of interested. That gives you guys an idea. This piece, about that thick. So, five inches, I don't know. But, here you guys go, let me know what you think.